Pertusio, the shout out app for industries, businesses, and services. What is the best way to start a successful food and beverage business? So you've created a fantastic beverage recipe. So what now? It can be scary to consider taking your product to the next level and going on the entrepreneurial path. There's a lot to consider. Where are you going to sell? How will you compete with other products? In order to succeed in the food and beverage industry, every entrepreneur must perform the following six things. One, begin small and work your way up. It's critical to start modestly, so you don't take on more than you're capable of. However, you should structure your company so that you can expand as your sales increase. Rather than developing wholly new processes and systems, you should be able to expand on existing ones. As you grow, you should look for more companies to join your system. You will need to find a co-packer to manufacture and package your product for you. Using a co-packer may reduce your capital requirements and allow you to devote more time and resources to growing your business. Then, as your business expands, you'll want to hire a beverage distributor to warehouse your goods and sell them to shops on your behalf. Selecting a distributor that complements the company's goals requires time and effort. 2. Form a strong field team. Your mobile workforce is an important component of your success since they will represent your product and your company in the field. To put together a good field squad, you must first select the correct representatives. When interviewing, look for people that share your excitement as well as your dedication and goals. You want to develop a positive culture inside your team once you've located the proper people to make up your team. Because mobile reps typically work alone, it's critical that everyone feels connected and to the firm. Mobile CRM or food distribution software is an excellent tool for improving communication between sales representatives and management. Remote team tracking technologies can also help your team develop an accountability and excellence culture. 3. Develop a retail execution strategy. You now have a fantastic field merchandising staff. However, even the strongest team will fall short of successful food and beverage merchandising without an organized retail execution plan. You must design a strategy and adapt it as the market evolves. You should be aware of your target audience and competitors. What elicits a response from your target audience? What are your competitors doing to get people to notice them? Again, good food distribution software will enable you to gather and analyze rival data. Merchandising will play a significant role in your success. The appearance and availability of your product in-store are critical. Therefore, you should have an organized plan for field reps when they visit a store. Where should the product be located? How should it be presented? Is everything fronted? How is it being advertised? These particulars will set you apart from your competitors. 4. Create outstanding packaging. The appearance of your product is critical in establishing its identity. Spend time creating a high-quality product that looks and feels great. You may learn more about current packaging trends by reading these guidelines. However, don't overlook the practical aspects of packing. Consider how your product will fit on a shelf or in a display as well as whether its shape and size are feasible. 5. Publicize. Then you must advertise. You don't want to attack your competition head-on if you've established a product in a pre-existing category. Instead, set yourself apart from them. Find your competitor's weakness and use it to your advantage. Focusing on developing a culture around your business is an excellent advertising technique. Consider this. Who are you as a company? What is the message you wish to convey? What will elicit a response from your target audience? Consider Nantucket Nectars as an example. They're the juice men, the laid back, just wanting to have fun kind. Tom and Tom are brothers. Six, continue to evolve. The food and beverage industry is continually expanding and adapting to consumer demand. Trends such as health drinks or energy drinks come and go. You should provide possibilities for consumer interaction it is critical that you continuously develop and adjust your product depending on user input. Customer input will drive your subsequent decisions. What will you expand on? Can you cut back on anything? You ensure the success of your product by basing decisions on client input. If you follow these basic suggestions, your food or beverage product will fly off the shelves. If you enjoyed watching this video, then give this video a like and share with a friend,
Also click on the subscribe button below to be notified as new videos are released.